Hello guys, uh, this is Mr. E143. So, we have here another example of the Kalmogorov uh, using SPSS. So, we have here a problem as a market survey was conducted to assess the reader's perception about the quality of the sports or sports coverage made by two newspapers. So our null hypothesis here is the reader perception is about the quality of the sports coverage made by two newspapers are similar. Okay. By the way, our data uh, of this uh, certain problem would already in our SPSS. So nandoon na yung mga data natin dito sa ating SPSS. So meron tayong two newspapers. Okay. So... So, dito tayo ngayon sa ating SPSS, newspapers, dalawa lang yan siya, 1, 2, and then the reader perception. Okay, punta tayo muna dito sa ating variable view. Okay, sa ating, uh, eto, decimal is here na lang na yun, parang di tayo malito. And sa values natin, dito sa newspaper, ayan, so, Gawin natin siyang A, B. Na number 1 is A, newspaper. And number 2 is the B, newspapers. Okay? So, okay natin yan. And then, dito tayo sa another, sa reader perception. So, our reader perception, meron tayong uh, Likert scale na lima. We have number 1, ang value natin sa 1, we have very ineffective. Number 2, moderately ineffective. Number 3, average standard. 4, moderately ineffective. And Number five is the very effective. Okay, so, i-okay natin. And then, our newspapers is nominal, measure dito, and ordinal siya dito sa reader perception. Okay, so, ito na yung ating data view. Ito na sila. Yan. Okay. So, to analyze this, let's go to the analyze, then sa taas, and then non-parametric, and then legacy dialogues. And this time, we have uh, two independent samples. So, ito ang click natin. Nung unang example natin, we have one sample kay yes. Okay? So, i-click lang natin itong two independent samples. Okay? Okay, then our sa newspaper, punta natin dito sa group variable. Okay, ang reader perception, punta natin dito sa test variable list. And exact, tingnan natin sa exact. Okay, wala na yan. Continue sa option. Okay, so wala na din ito. And then, dito, ang kukunin natin ay Kalmogorov Smirnov. Okay? Hindi man witness since ang uh, napin natin, you are going to analyze the Kalmogorov Smirnov test. Okay? So, itong i-check natin. Uh, by the way, itong sa group natin, okay, define group. One is group one and two. Okay. Kasi dalawa man yan. So continue. And click OK. And let's wait for the result. Okay. So end for test. To call Magar or to sample call Magarab Smirnov test. Okay. So our first table, we have the frequencies. So our reader perception, we have newspaper A, newspaper B. They are the same, uh, what do they call that? Sample, we have 150 and 150. So, therefore, overall, our total uh, sample size is 300. Okay, respondent or participant. So, punta tayo sa test statistics. We have the table 2, the reader perception, and most extreme differences. We have the absolute is 0 0.120, and the most extreme difference positive, we have 0 0.013, and the negative is negative. 0 0.120 the uh, test interest distribution okay then punta tayo dito sa level of significance 
So, ano nakikita natin? We have uh, zero point. Okay. Uh, zero point. Two, three, zero. Or point two, three, zero. So, what do we observe? Since our level of significance is greater than uh, uh, 0.05, therefore, we are going to accept the null hypothesis. Okay? By the way, our null hypothesis is... Ano null hypothesis natin? Okay, the reader perception is about the quality of the sports cup coverage made by two newspapers are similar okay so that's it thank you